Hey uh, YouTube family, um, I'm gonna assume the reason that you found this video is because you gotta take down a big mirror, like this one. This mirror is about, oh, it's about seven foot long. So um, I did the same thing that you did. I went on YouTube, I looked for different ways of doing it. Many people use duct tape, but uh, I'm gonna show you actually a better way. Okay, like I mentioned, that's, that's usually what you see on everybody else's videos, and I used to do that. You know, you take some duct tape, you know, kind of do your whole, obviously your whole mirror, um, and then the idea is that when you break the mirror, um, the, the tape will hold the bigger shards together, but still, it's dangerous. So again, this is what we use now. Like I mentioned, we're going to get full coverage. Uh, myself and my twin brother here, we're going to take care of covering this whole mirror. Make sure you get a good cover on it. Utility knife, of course, will cut. Alrighty, I took the, the shield and I put two coats on there so that I got a, a real thick, you know, base. And now it's a matter of a hammer. I'll probably mute this part um, in the video because it's going to be noisy. Okay, you can see I'm about halfway done here. All we're going to do is pieces and there's black glue behind these big mirrors so there that's what's holding it up there right now once I release that it's all gonna fall so like I said it's it's kind of noisy so make sure that you've got gloves glasses and uh, a good place for it to fall make sure if you have your vanity in here that you're gonna cover it all up uh, but in my case here I got a brand new floor that I and these uh these um, light fixtures are going too so I don't care if, even if I hit those Okay, that's the condition. You can see that it's actually releasing already up at the top. Like I said, once this starts going, it's all gonna come down. Now, in, if you'd like, you can cut it into smaller pieces so it'll come apart in more manageable pieces. But there's no way that a one guy could have been able to take down this huge mirror. And even if I did do it in one piece, Nobody really takes these, so they have to go to the dump or be broken up for the garbage anyway. down we got all cleaned up you can see this is the patches where um, the black glue was that holds that mirror and uh, of course as expected you know, we've got some other drywall repairs here in this room anyway so that whole big mirror that spanned from there all the way to there is now in there so um, some tips too is that before you start a project like this make sure that you count all your fingers before and then after, and one, two, three, four, five, I'm good. So be very careful when you do this. I hope this video may have helped somebody. Um, please share it with any of your friends that are in the remodeling business. And as always, um, check back on my channel 
Um, there might be some other um, tips that I might come up with that uh, might help you out. All right, thanks a lot for watching.